All right, so first thing when it comes to shooting a backhand, you're going to want to know what kind of curve you have. Um, it's something called the lie, which is uh, what part of your blade that sits on the ice. Uh, so for my blade, I have a bit more of a toe curve, as you can see here. It's, a, it's got a good hook at the toe. Um, so with that hook at the toe, you don't want to be using the toe for your backhand. So I'm going to be using the, uh, the heel of the curve to take a backhand here. Um, that's going to help me get more power behind it as we shoot. So for a guy like Gus Ford, he's got less of a, a hook on his curve, so he can use the whole curve uh, anywhere he wants for his backhand. But for me, I really have to use the heel. So you want to know what curve you have before you're taking your backhand. Second thing, it's a lot like a wrist shot. So you're going to still want to push down on the ice a little bit when you bring it back, cradle it, and then release like that. So now when would you use a backhand in a game, let's say the goalie's on the other side of the net and I don't have time to drag it and shoot, I would want to just cradle it and shoot that in the net. Or maybe even pop it a bit higher if I can, like that. Um, another time you would use a backhand often is on a breakaway where you can fake it and come around the goalie and put it up like that.